showing you guys my updated brow routine. I started off doing soap brows in the beginning of the summer, I believe. And I figured out that this technique that I'm about to show you guys basically gives you the same look as the soap brows without actually having to use soap. So I'm going to jump right into the video. These are what my natural brows are looking like. I cleaned them up a couple days before and I'm going to be using ColourPop Brow Pencil and I always use the shade Bangin' Brunette. And this pencil is like $5 y'all and it's super bomb. So I start off using the spoolie end of the pencil and I am combing my brows out i like to do them up to start off so i'm going to take that pencil and i'm just going to underline the natural line of my brow and i didn't speed this part up i wanted you guys to see this in real time so for the front of my brow i literally just do brush strokes upwards just to make it look like hair i think this looks much better than doing like the full blown line across the top part of your brow so now i'm just filling in the sparse areas before i actually go and on the top of my brow just to make them look a little bit more full so now I'm gonna brush my brow hairs down and this brow I'll have to take it a little bit higher than my actual brow hairs because it is not as arched as my left brow so I'm just following that shape but just going a little bit above where my hairs are and then I'm gonna brush my hairs back up and just fill in those sparse areas I really like my tail to be dark so I'm going to just fill that in. You guys, this is super simple. And like I said, this is in real time. I didn't speed it up until I got on my left brow. So this is what I do. And you want to use a really, really light hand because you don't want your brows to be too dark. But I do like my tail dark. So I'm going to go ahead to my left brow and do the same thing. And I know it's going to look like it's curved a little bit. I'm going to fix that. But again, make a line at the bottom. And then I do the light brush strokes with the pencil upwards. And yeah, it's the same thing. So I'm gonna let you guys watch that and then I'm going to go ahead and clean them up. Okay, so to clean my brows up, I'm using the ColourPop No Filter Concealer and I'm using the shade, this is the old shade 40. I'm not sure what it is now. I will find out for you guys and put it in the description box. This concealer is $6 and it's one of my favorite concealers, you guys. So I'm going to be using this Morphe E19 brush. It's my favorite brush to carve my brows out. And just doing this just really sharpens your brows and just makes them look super popping. So this is not a, a step that you can skip. Like you have to carve your brows out. I promise you they will look so bomb. Just make sure you blend that concealer out. So I'm just going up under my brow and just cleaning up anything that was outside of what it should have been I'm just gonna clean that bottom part up and I like to use a concealer that's a little bit lighter but not too light and then for the top part of my brow I'm going to be using the shade 50 like I said I will leave the new shades in the description box or put them on the screen right here i'm just coming around that arch and just cleaning up the tail to make it look extra crisp and sharp but yeah you guys like this brow routine is so easy and simple just use a light hand and follow these steps and i promise you your brows will be popping And to blend out the front part of my brow, I either use the spoolie or I use a Q-tip. Q-tips really blend out better than the spoolie in my opinion. So yeah, I'm using my spoolie to blend everything out. But like I said, I feel like a Q-tip works so much better, but I did not have one on hand. So I just went ahead and used the spoolie. So pretty much after I do that, I go ahead and do the rest of my makeup and then I come back when I'm all completely done with my makeup and I use the L'Oreal Telescopic Carbon Black Mascara. It has the perfect wand for this and I set my brows. But what this does, like y'all, this mascara is so perfect. It makes your brows, like do y'all see how hair like my brows look? That mascara just pops your brows all the way off, sis. So yeah, you guys, this is my quick updated brow routine. I hope y'all enjoy it. Let me know if you try it. Leave me any video requests down below, and I will catch y'all in my next video.
I'm so into you. For real, bread like I'm keen to you. If you were 10, I add 10 to you. They be mad when I 10 to you. That's what the bay like. Call me Buffy, cause that's what I slay like. These bitches, I sun them like it's daylight.